Hello everyone, this is Shadow Slayer X, and this is the Spell Damage Death Rattle Draw Hearthstone Challenge. So about half the deck um, rather contains the words Spell, Damage, Death Rattle, or Draw in the card text. Uh, if you didn't watch the last episode, um, it was an interesting draft. And due to the challenge, when a legendary popped up, I had to go with Millhouse Mana Storm because he had the word spells in his text. He was up against Nosdormu and Alakir. Oh, uh, my heart sank. But, uh, you know what? I, I didn't compromise the challenge as much as uh, it pained me to, but. Alright, so we're up against a grumpy kitten. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Things are going great. Okay, it's something. I don't think hunters have the best way to deal with the one manas. Well played. Well played. I think greetings, traveler. This guy's vocal. Tracking. Oh no. We might be screwed, friends. We just might be screwed. It really does it really makes me not want to play, um. These guys that have one mana health because he can just unleash the hounds, kill both of them. We would have spent the same amount of mana, but oh, I am not a morning person. Mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna lose them both, but. I think it's funny. Uh, I'll do that. So you here, you there. Of course, I just knew it. I knew the priestess would heal the totem. I didn't call it out, but in my head. All right, grumpy kitten. Show me what you got. Okay, I was like, where's the card? Lightning bolt. Okay. Hmm. Should we test? Yeah, I guess we have to. More training. Hey, freezing trap ain't bad. Comes a three mana card. If we play it again, that gets buffed to zero five. If we play the other one, he becomes a four three. Yeah, let's do that. I guess Freezing Trap is kind of like <clears throat> the best one I could have got, but. Unleash the Hounds? Okay. <laughs> Not much of a choice of like where to go, what to do there. We'll do that for now. Hmm. If I can play the sea giant next turn, if. He doesn't kill stuff. Should I play it on the left or the right? Oh crud. Oh crud. Ay ay ay. Hmm. <laughs> 
if he's got an explosive trap, I lose this one. Uh, let's, well, I guess let's You're test. And if it dies, it comes up on the other side, right? Oh, well. here it goes. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Hey, no, it did. It came back like exactly. That's something. And if that snipe. You can snipe this. And this is probably a good time to pump this in. Awesome. I am mind control techable. I am susceptible to explosive shots. Extremely to uh, explosive trap. Multi-shot. If he has no spells, I'm in a good position. Okay, he had to kill command that. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. No, I feel like... No. Alright, let's get... It's not the one I wanted, uh, but I'll take it. Okay, he's got to do something soon. He doesn't have my control tech, or he hasn't drawn it. Um, I really wanted a healing totem, but... Yeah, I was going to say if you didn't kill that one. Yeah. Oh, good choice. Bloodlust does plus three. So that is seven, five, and four. Which is... That's enough, right? Seven, five is twelve. Yeah, okay. Oh yeah! All right. Well played, Grumpy Kitten. Destroy them all. Okay, moving on. Millhouse Man of Storm. D don't get me wrong. In the back of my mind, like there was like this like evil version of myself doing the Mr. Burns like two hands together going yes play me last man of storm play him but I was like nah as fun as it would be he probably has something okay we're up against Karma the League of Legends champion for Doomhammer. Uh, Hmm. Hmm. It's a paladin. Uh, turn one, summon something. Turn two, hero power. Nah. Yeah, it's turn one, Milhouse Metastorm. This okay. This might be horrible. Oops. Greetings, friend. Millhouse Mana Storm. Double consecrate. Avenging Wrath. That'd be funny. What could he play that would be the ultimate horribleness? Shields up. That's it. Excellent. Uh, yeah. 
You would get the one one. I need the healing totem. If I put this apple on your head. Don't summon anything else. Yes. Okay. Do I play aggressive? Aggressive meaning I lightning bolt the thing and hit him for nine. Yeah. This is the turn where a consecrate, like, flips the table. Cross my fingers. Doesn't have it? Or he might have a true silver champion and it's like, well, what, what do I hit? Twilight Drake. Okay. Ah. <sighs> Direwolf, direwolf, direwolf. I guess I'm consigned to losing Millhouse this turn. The only way I wouldn't lose Millhouse is if I got a Stone Tusk Totem, which I can't rely on because it's a 33% chance. Hmm. Or should I? Should I just risk it? If I risk it, I feel like I'm screwed though. Ugh. Now we'll play safe. Alright, now if you had consecrate this is the time to use it because I think I have lethal next turn if he doesn't kill anything six plus four is ten plus uh, seven king. seventeen yeah there's the charge All right do I still have lethal um, probably not but let's just do the math anyway six and three it's nine plus seven is sixteen. Oh, crap. Should I just hit him for everything anyway? Sure. And now, if the leper gnome dies, well, met. <laughs> well played. Well played. Bam! This deck. This luck. Yay! All right, let's go for at least one more. Can the luck continue? <sighs> Drinking some Rockstar punched energy drink. Fruit punch flavor. Alright, Raise Rag. Good name. Rubbed Priest. Is this the one that will take us down? Great compared to the other hands I've started off with. Greetings, friend. I hate this kind of hand because I don't have a turn to play. Apparently, neither is he. Where were you the last two games? I mean, I did fine without you, but. If I roll need. 
Are you smiting me? Oh. No, that's way smarter. <laughs> Is flame if I play flame tongue and the young priest is on the other side. Is that better? What? Do you have two of them? That would be a four one. Yeah. Do you need a blessing? <laughs> Excellent. Now this is where we get the shadow word pain on the zero three, right? Oh jeez. That's interesting. Sorry, I, I'm like just waiting in anticipation, being like, what's he gonna do? How's he gonna do this? Let's see what we get. Oh, this just keeps getting better and better. Let the pain speak to me. <clears throat> A very interesting three three over there. <laughs> Man, your power shields. Interesting uses. My shield. Perfect. That's excellent. So we wait, wait, wait. Pain. Bring the pain. Boom. Totemic might. The funny thing is, the healing totem's right in the middle range. I smell blood. Hmm. What to do? Okay, so we lightning bolt, send him in, and hit the other guy directly. Now let's assume he kills that. Man, this challenge deck, amazing. So far. I mean, usually I do really bad in the first one, or I do really good. So, we'll see. And there's no beating around the bush. And use the healing totem, which kills him in the first place. Perfect. Oh, 
Okay. I think that was a great first episode. Um, yeah, the spell damage, death rattle, draw uh, deck worked for the first three wins. Um, so, something I've been thinking about also is I feel like uh, the first three wins are like your first category, your first phase, and then you move into like phase two or category two where you put up against better players, and every three wins, I feel you're put into a higher tier category. Um, so, hopefully, next episode isn't one of the two losses, one win, push me to third video, which has happened m many, many a time. But, yeah, this is awesome. Also, doo -doo -doo. if anyone's wondering, at the time of me putting out this episode, I still haven't crafted my legendary, so uh, please feel free to comment on who I should get. I'm looking about, I'm looking to get some someone like Karen, Nat Pagel, Tinkmaster Overspark, or who's the other one? Uh, Leroy. So, or even possibly Edwin, but I think I should go for the neutrals before I go for the class legendaries. Anyway, this is Shadow Slayer X, and we'll see you next time.